Hello everyone. Welcome to part 7 of my Neverwhere project on City Skylines. Last time I had a bit of a traffic problem which I did some work sorting out. Uh, just at the end last time I noticed another traffic issue which uh, I need to address this time around. Um, it was this particular area here and I thought perhaps adjusting this interchange so that there was at least some access into here might help at least going this way so um, I'm going to do just that uh, okay so I'm going to need to take the ramp off back here. Okay. Okay, let's see. Let's see if that makes any difference right there. As other commentators have observed, uh, much of the uh, key to dealing with traffic on this game is providing alternative paths for it to go if you can't just get rid of it. So, and I think just that one ramp is all I'm going to need. Although I may want a ramp coming off going the other way as well. But there we go. There's traffic using it. And it appears to have reduced the traffic heading for the other uh, I think perhaps there might be a benefit also bringing a ramp directly into here. But that's not nearly so clear. That has reduced some of the traffic load here, so uh, overall I think this has been successful. Right, the other thing I was uh, looking at doing was turning this into two ramps as opposed to an actual intersection, and probably the same thing over here. And that may reduce the traffic light effect, and that may help as well. So, doing that, I'm going to try that. Uh, but that's going to require some demolition. Uh, yeah. Uh, inconvenient that that had to happen. Um, what the? 
I built it straight before. Uh, right, I did it like this. And then I converted it. Right. Now, I think I need to do this this way. Need about the shortest stub there. And I need a curve here. Oh yes, the park is in the way. Okay, so I'll relocate that. Now, I can try my really okay I'll try that I think I might want to upgrade this ramp as well. Well, it really isn't working any better. I wonder if a ramp off of here would help. Just to take some pressure off the roundabout.
Let's uh, slow this down. Now, what I want to know is where Okay, I have a lot of traffic going all the way around and coming up into here. Okay. So, what I'm going to try and do is bring a ramp off Oops, I had it. into the industrial. Now, let's see if that makes a difference.
Well, that made a difference. Wow, that made a huge difference. Okay, so I've got a traffic issue over here still, but I'm not sure how to solve it. Well, maybe if I shrink this one to a single lane, Okay, so I have stacks of cars going all over the place here. But where What I really need is a connector in through to here, I think. That is a mess of uh, ramps and roads though, isn't it? If I come up and over, well, I don't have a lot of traffic. Okay, it's all going. I think I've got the, uh, oh, I see. That's a one-way road, right. I wonder if changing this one back to two-way helps. And that one as well. And here as well.
<sighs> I wonder if that improves traffic over here. I wonder if that means we get more going straight through at that intersection. Okay, I know what I'm going to do there. Whoop, no, that's not what I want. I want uh, this one. I'm going to... Take out this intersection. Actually, I don't know that I can. But I'm going to try this. Snap to grid. to go there. Oh, come on. Really? You can't build a road exactly side by side? Okay. Then I won't. Really? Okay. Now... Now let's see what happens here. I wonder... Okay, I'm gonna try something here. After I let things settle for a little bit here.
Okay. And if I drop that down to one lane, what happens? Right, okay. No, that doesn't work. Well, as you can see, you can spend forever uh, sorting out traffic problems. But for the moment, I think I can leave things alone. over there anyway. I really do need to push a major road through here, but uh, we'll call this a unfortunate uh, historical uh, road layout like so many uh, cities actually have. I've got a fairly busy uh, road situation over here too. I don't think there's any good way to sort this one out. Although... Let's see, where's it going? Maybe some benefit to uh, let's see. might be some benefit to that.
but it looks more like it's just way too much traffic. Okay. Now, I, uh, I figure naming these stations would make it a little easier to work out where trains are going. Um, when I actually query them. And yes, I did call both of them the same thing because this is really one station just separated so that uh, the uh, stations can separate the uh, internal and external uh, traffic here. And it will keep uh, having dozens of uh, mostly empty trains going to the internal stations and exiting the city or entering the city and going there, uh, which keeps the train congestion on this line relatively light. Clearly at some point I'm going to have to deal with the traffic issues here, but uh, realistically, I think I just need to develop some things here. Uh, I've got a full cemetery there. Um, okay. So this is what happens with a uh, somewhat organically uh, developed uh, area. Uh, you end up with some uh, fairly uh, inconvenient uh, layouts. Uh, now what's the next milestone? Uh, Colossal City at 48,000, okay. To get there, I'm going to need some more um, residential and um, commercial and stuff. Uh, so what... Uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to, I think, I'm going to put a, a residential development over here. Uh, okay, so I'm going to back off to slow speed here. Now, because I want to avoid as much of the major traffic issues as possible what well, I'm and I'm gonna want a decent backbone uh, road here I'm gonna go with a six lane backbone along about here Uh, 
this backbone is going to be limited access. And I'm going to build a sort of clover leaf, well, uh, interchange thingy over here um, with some substantial ramps eventually, but um, initially. I'll go with um, saner ramps. Reverse those because those are the inbound. Uh, now I need the other direction. Okay, and I got uh, this one going the wrong way. Okay, it's so nice since the 1.0.6 patch that you can reverse the direction of one-way roads trivially. Okay. is going the wrong way. No, it's not. That is the right way. this fixed okay so that's a major road okay and coming off of this I'm going to set up a six lane road about here. Okay. That's not quite what I want. I need to back off a bit further.
Now, uh, I'm just going to make an intersection. Okay. Okay. There is an intersection. Now, uh, okay. Okay, so I'll bring in a road across that way. And I'll bring in a road. the angle wrong. Now oh, this might do it. Okay. So, between these two roads, I will set up an area for well, up here, Okay. No. Oh, that was right. Okay, now I'm going to bring another I need to bring electricity and water up there.
Okay. I'm going to try a different road layout uh, scheme here. theory here is that with a larger road available going toward the employment down here the uh, traffic won't want to uh, go on the uh, side roads uh, which may have some merit Okay, so first up, education, education, and more education. Okay, now for some zoning. along the main road here. Uh, 
Okay, now there's something else I need up here. What is it? Oh yes. Parts. Okay, I'll speed this up, and we'll see what happens. And while I'm doing that, I'm going to check on some stuff here. Okay, education's doing well. And demographics are okay. And power will help up there. Now, I'm going to put a metro line along here. think it'll need to connect. Where is it? It'll need to connect into this one. Okay, so that'll need to connect. <sighs> okay. That sound means time is running out, or maybe not, because this is not Wheel of Fortune. Uh, what I'm going to do, though, while I'm at this, is add a road connector here. Now, what have I got coming in here? Private cars, okay. So I'll make one more metro connection here. Okay. 
Okay. Now, oh, right. I should uh, maybe. I'm going to put a station down there. need to put a line Okay, so hopefully that's enough to reduce some car trips. I think perhaps these need to be further apart. Okay, well, I'll deal with that in the next part. Oh, interesting. Okay, so uh, well, so next time I'm going to move these further apart so there's more storage space in between the directions here. Um, anyway, uh, okay. Well, that's the end of this part, so I'll see everybody back in the next one. Thanks for watching.